While the president meets with French President Emmanuel Macron in Paris, the Russia problem continues here at home. CBS News contributor Frank Luntz spoke with a panel of lawmakers about the ongoing investigations into the Kremlin's interference in the 2016 election. And I think we all have bipartisan support and respect for Bob Mueller. Yeah, I have every confidence in that investigation. I got this briefing, what they call the Gang of Eight, last October on the Russian meddling in our elections. It was not a gray area. It was very black and white, clear and convincing. It was happening. But I think most of us in this room agree that there should be a consequence to Crimea being annexed, Ukraine being Absolutely. invaded, the Russians interfering in our in democracy, right. and we will have a sanctions bill against Russia on the floor of the House, I hope, in the very, very near future. Really so how many of you agree with what the chairman just said? Raise your hands. Yeah. So we have, actually, on Russia, we have bipartisanship. Well, the only person who disagrees with the chairman is the president. And, and while he disagrees with it, he's running down NATO, he's running down uh, the European Union, and Putin couldn't ask for a better friend than that. So I really hope that you guys will move that sanctions bill. As much as that's an issue right now, and that to me, that's become too much of an issue as to what our real job is. If we're more concentrating on the Russians interfering with our elections, as opposed to the Russians interfering with our economy right now, and us turning away from our real job of getting people back to work, seeing wages rise again, seeing families be able to be together. But Congressman, look, the Russians attacked our elections. We need to respond to the Russians. No, and we need to do the work you're talking about on the economy. We need no. to do both. What we don't need to do is come here week after week after week and do nothing. You can see more of Frank Luntz's panel on CBS This Morning this Friday and catch even more on Monday's episode of Red and Blue right here on CBSN.